What's up guys, Travis Stevenson here. And in today's Whiteboard Wednesday, we're gonna be talking about affiliate marketing. Look, over the last 10 to 11 years, I've been running my business online 100%, and I've generated over $4.5 million in that time frame, either promoting other people's products or having them promote mine. And I think it's just way too simple not to talk about. So what I wanted to do was kind of break down just how simple it is by showing you on the whiteboard. So we're going to go inside. We're going to talk about some of my best affiliate marketing adventures, some of the ones that even some of my friends have told me about. And I'm going to explain how affiliate marketing actually works so that you can take advantage of it too. Let's do it. All right, so let's talk about affiliate marketing. I think this is probably one of the biggest opportunities for everybody out there because it's along the lines of stuff that you're already doing. Um, and it's just most people aren't paying attention to the fact that it's actually really easy to turn like a very basic kind of recommendation into affiliate marketing revenue. And I wanna start by telling you a really interesting story of a friend of mine who actually used this idea of affiliate marketing um, and tell you a couple of stories of my own as well. So uh, one of my buddies actually owns a pretty cool YouTube channel. His name is Adrian Brambilla. He just re recently posted a story about one of the times that he used affiliate marketing to get like 75 of his favorite shirts. Um, and essentially the story is he really liked this shirt company called Meisen and Main, and they had a referral program where if you referred one person and they bought a shirt, you would get like a $75 gift card um, and he just leveraged that to the max and he figured out really cool ways to get people who already wanted their shirts to just go use his link when they were going to buy them. And so, um, there's affiliate programs, which is about every single different, uh, platform that you could ever spend money on, right? So Amazon is one of the largest affiliate systems out there and they'll give you an in between four to typically 6% of any sale that you generate. And I know that doesn't sound all that entertaining, but if you sell a camera, or if you sell furniture, if you sell something expensive, that can start to really add up. Or if you can sell, make recommendations for a lot of very small products, you can also make a good amount of money. So what's really interesting to me and, and one thing that I've always focused on in my career is if I ever buy something or if I ever use something, let's say a software, my first question as soon as I get in is always, okay, I want to document like the first thing that I always try to make sure that I do is I document my process of using this tool successfully. So another really cool example is a company called Sendlane. They're an email marketing platform. Um, one of the, one of the better ones out there if you're in the affiliate marketing space as well. Um, and when they very first launched, they launched with an affiliate platform and I believe it was 30 or 40% per month. If you recommended somebody over to their platform, you would make monthly revenue off of that. And so now all I've got to do, I signed up, I started sending some emails, things went pretty well, and I was like, okay, great, documented a little bit of it and turned that into a little bit of a story. Then you either post that on YouTube, post it on Facebook, or you go to live events, let's say, and you say, oh yeah, I'm using Sendlane, and they'll say, hey, do you have a, a link that I can check out? Yeah, you know, it's not too difficult. So uh, it's, it's amazing because that same affiliate sort of recommendation that I made, I started referring people to Sendlane probably five years ago. Um, and I still, to this day, make around 200 to $400 every single month off of people who are using Sendlane. Um, and so I think it's really important that you guys understand what affiliate marketing is. And I'll, I'll walk you guys through a couple more stories of some of the, the times that I've used affiliate marketing and how I use it now and how you could absolutely take this. And even if you don't have much of a following, how you can take it and start profiting from it. So we're going to dive in by first explaining how affiliate marketing actually works and why it's something that pretty much right now you could start profiting from. So the idea is really simple. In order to do anything online, in order to profit from a venture online, you're going to need a couple of things. The first thing that you need um, is going to be people, right? So the first thing that any online offer needs is people that are interested potentially in buying that product. Then you need some form of website online. We'll just put this. You need some sort of tool or system that can actually get them to buy the product and you need some, obviously you need some way of delivering that product. So we'll just go ahead and put, you know, this is post sale, some way of taking the transaction. And what's great is 
what the most important part of this entire process is right here, is understanding that if you control the people, then you control the profit. So the whole method with affiliate marketing that matters right now is there's likely almost every day in your life, somebody asking you, hey, what'd you think of that movie? Hey, uh, I love that thing that you had on your table. Where can I get it? Hey, that those headphones that you were wearing the other day, you know, where can I find them? And so a great example of how this is actually, you know, affiliate marketing has really blown up in the last three years is take for instance something like Instagram. Uh, you might you might see Instagram influencers being like, hey, you know, look at these great headphones. They're basically doing affiliate marketing for the headphone company because the headphone company understands the most important thing is the people. Anybody can make headphones. That's why you see headphone companies popping up all over the place. You see uh, energy drink companies popping up all over the place because anybody can make those things now. The key is how do I get people? And so there's so many different and unique ways to do this. And I want to talk to you guys about a few of them right now, but essentially what happens is you can find other people's products. You can go to their website and they have affiliate systems and you can sign up for them. And all you've got to do is figure out how can I get people to their website to purchase their product. And then you typically will make anywhere between 30% to 50%. Now, there, is, um, there are some platforms out there that will give you more than that. Some platforms actually go as high as 100% on the initial sale. I'm a little bit skeptic of the 100% model because that means they obviously have zero overhead in this, which means they're probably not doing a lot of customer support. They might not be doing a lot of like innovation with the product. They're literally giving somebody, you know, if you sell something for 35 bucks and somebody's giving you 35 bucks, that's tough. And it also usually means that they're really hardcore selling those customers on the back end. I want to feel good about referring people to businesses. So um, anywhere between 30 to 50% is usually a good number. And so one example of this that I've used and that I continuously make, uh, actually, we're just looking these stats up for another video that we'll be shooting. So keep your eyes out for this. Um, actually, this is a really good time to remind you to subscribe, hit the like button on this video, because when I post that next video, which is going to be eight passive ways that I generate $10,054 every single month. One of the methods that I'm going to be talking about is this little story that I'll be telling you here about affiliate marketing, and that is promoting uh, other people's websites like ClickFunnels and Kartra. Uh, so whenever I'm building my business, I have to build landing pages, I have to build sales pages, I have to build membership products, all this, and I use two platforms. I use ClickFunnels and I use Kartra. So here's how it works. Super simple. I used Kartra, or I used ClickFunnels. I actually got these amazing two Comma Club awards. And I, so I generated a funnel that did seven figures um, throughout the course of the funnel, right? I was promoting it, it made over a million dollars. So that made me a little bit of a specialist in this. And I then said, hey, if you are out there in internet land and you want the exact funnel that I use that made me a million dollars and you wanna take a training on how I was able to do that, just click below and when you sign up for ClickFunnels, I'll give you access to this free course and the template. And so what's great is I still make right around 500 bucks every single month. And I haven't told anybody to go sign up for ClickFunnels in a long time, not actively, right? Because I make 40% every single month of everybody who uses ClickFunnels. So um, another great little example, and I, and I, I really want you guys to hone in on the examples because I think it's really important. Um, it, look, let's look at a gym, for instance. If I go to a gym and I said, hey, gym owner, I have a website template right here that would help you get more leads for your gym. I don't want to charge you for it. All you've got to do is sign up for ClickFunnels. When you sign up, I'll give you the template. You're done. You'd probably be able to get a gym owner to sign up for that. Well, now let's imagine you do that times 10 people. Well, what's great is ClickFunnels, for instance, is $97 a month for every single account, right? Times 40% that comes out to be about $34 or so. Um, and 34 times 10 people means you could make $340. Even if they don't use any of the upgraded stuff, because ClickFunnels goes uh, from 997 up to, I believe, 697, if the person wanted to go even more extreme on that. So you imagine if one person even upgrades to the 697 from this because they want more features, well, now you're making even more money. So what's great is once you sell them once and they start using the website and they like it, well, they're not going to cancel. 
right? You can't cancel a website that you're sending traffic to. So it, it's just really cool. And after a couple of months, everybody even forgets that they, you know, most of the time even got it from you. So the whole idea of affiliate marketing is taking things that people need. And this is the mistake that a lot of people make. Take things that people need and help them get that. And you do that by finding the people who need something. So let's say you're going with an affiliate program for Chatmatic, right? We have an affiliate program. And so I'm just gonna put Chatmatic here, right? Let's say you're going to promote Chatmatic's affiliate program. Now Chatmatic has a $0 14 day trial. After 14 days, it's either 97 or 149, right? So let's imagine you get 10 people at that, you would make $34, we pay 40%. So it's basically the same affiliate kind of system. Well, now you can be making $340 by helping people get Chatmatic. So here's how you do this as an affiliate marketer. You've got to find the people that need or want or might want Chatmatic, right? So how do I find those people? Okay, so let's talk about a couple of scenarios. Number one, you can absolutely find those people by making videos. Okay, so videos, and I don't just mean uh, videos and then and, and only posting them on YouTube because a lot of people are like, well, Travis, I have no idea what to do on YouTube. This is actually an effective strategy on YouTube. I'm gonna put YT on Facebook and on Instagram. And you could probably do the same thing now on TikTok. Uh, I'm seeing some pretty cool stuff happen there. So. Essentially what you would do is you would make a piece of content. Let's say you are an affiliate for Chatmatic and you go through and you make a really cool template and it's for real estate agents, okay? What you would do is you would go and you would post that video on your Facebook fan page and you would share that video into groups that have real estate agents and it's just got to be a teaching style, information style video. Another huge mistake when it comes to these videos is somebody saying, oh, well, you know, in the video, I'm gonna mention that you can get a free trial. Don't do that. Because people don't like to be told, go buy this. They want it to come naturally. It's, it's just like in the movie Inception, when they say that the thought has to come from themselves. It can't be like them being told, hey, you really need Chatmatic, right? Because then people are instantly gonna think in their head, why do I need Chatmatic? And the, the downside is, and, and I've learned this from, from some really intelligent marketers, as soon as you tell somebody, you need this, it means in, in, in their mind what's happening is they're saying I'm not good enough. They're saying that I am that there's something wrong with me. And getting somebody to admit that there's something wrong with them is a very, very hard thing to do, right? That's why the number one step of rehab is admitting that you have a problem, right? Because that's the most difficult thing to do is you have to self-reflect and admit, I, I'm not doing this right. And that's not a comfortable thing for people to do. So you want that to come from them. So what, how, you, how do you do that? You do that by showing people videos of whatever the product is. And this is why I love, I love being affiliates for products that I use, not just random products out there. Oh, I'm gonna take that one because it looks like it converts well. Use it yourself, make sure that it actually has value and then recommend it to people. And so again, you post this on Facebook, post it on YouTube, post it on Instagram, post it on TikTok, and you're gonna start getting attention. Do that once a week. Share these into Facebook groups. You know, make sure you're using the right hashtags. This video isn't necessarily for how to generate tons of traffic as an affiliate, but this is one really cool way, right? You can do you can do videos with this, and then in the link in the description, you can link over to your affiliate link. Um, that's one incredibly simple way that you can do affiliate marketing. But what's also another way is by creating your own funnels, right? So let's say you have people, and you drive them over to a landing page that you own, okay? A landing page that you control, where you're gonna ask them for their name and email in exchange for you know, some freebie. So let's say again, you're promoting Chatmatic, maybe this freebie says, how would you like this 20 page PDF that, that shows you the five easiest ways to profit from Messenger? People are gonna opt into that. Now what's great is, you're gonna collect their email, and then on the redirect, you're gonna redirect them to an affiliate offer where they can actually buy that thing. So now you've shown that they've shown you that they have interest, you now have their email, and what's amazing is you can now run email campaigns after you collect their email. You can run email campaigns, and I have plenty of videos on this channel already 
explaining some really cool email campaigns that you guys can run, but you can run email campaigns that get them to go back to this offer. Um, that's how I started my career. Guys, I've done at this point well over $4 million in sales promoting other people's products or having them promote mine. And the core is finding people that are, that are right for whatever you're trying to sell. Um, a great example would be if you go to, uh, you know, let's say Chewy.com. Uh, I'm pretty sure Chewy.com has an affiliate program and they're a, a, a company that ships dog food to people's front door, right? And if you go to Chewy.com and you're like, oh, this is a great product, because it is, it's, it's a great product to sell. But then you start marketing it to people who don't have a dog, you're not gonna get any sales. Right? It doesn't make sense for you to just go out and be like, hey, do you have a dog? Because if you have a dog, you should use Chewy. Go to areas where people already have dogs and figure out how to, in the right way, influence them to understand, oh, this thing could be a cool platform. Now, what I love about videos is if you can post these videos for, for, for natural purposes. So let's say you're promoting Chewy. You do a cool little video of you going to the front door and grabbing a special treat and then you play with your dog in the video and it's a funny kind of viral video. You can get a ton of views. Now let's talk about that. So let's say you get a ton of views. You're going to get 20,000 views, right? You post a video and you get 20,000 views. But you post that video into dog groups like I love my pug or, or you know all these different dog groups, right? And what happens is you can now create a new audience of people. You, could, you have an audience of people who watched that video, right? They, they watched it. And so what you can do is you can tell Facebook, show an ad to all of these people, right? So here's your ad. Show an ad to all these people. And when they click on that ad, send them to my affiliate link. And that's how simple it can be, right? You create an audience of people. And now some of the best affiliate marketers have what I would call inherited audiences. So the more you focus on building your email list, the easier affiliate marketing comes. And now that's why I've been able to do so well in my lifetime as an affiliate, because when I very first started, um, what I did was I helped other people launch their product. I started meeting people who had lists. Right, so I met a guy who had a list of like 30,000 people who were interested in marketing. I released a product on marketing and he promoted it for me. He made a bunch of sales and I built my email list. Now when he launched, I then promoted his thing, right? So that got a little tired after a while. I realized that ultimately you can't continuously do that, right? You can't build a list of 10,000 people and then spend the next three months beating them up, making them buy other things. There's nothing, and I mean nothing wrong with promoting products that are that are like that matter and that can help the you know industry and the people that you're that you're working with, and also remember, um, as a side note to email, if you build a list of ten thousand people and you sell and you get you know a hundred sales a month, that means that nine thousand nine hundred people on your email list haven't bought these products. So that's why you can consistently promote new things because not everybody on your list has bought something. Not, they didn't, it didn't fill their need yet. So you should still promote other things to help them find the answer to the problem that you're trying to help them solve. So what I love about affiliate marketing is this whole method, this whole system, it is, it's so simple. Um, the, the keys, and, and I want you guys to really, really take this with you, the, the keys to having an effective and powerful and very profitable long-term affiliate business Number one, first and foremost, promote recurring products. I know that's gonna sound scary to a lot of you because they don't convert as high as a, as a low ticket item, right? So let's say, for instance, this, this product here, this is Chatmatic, right? Chatmatic is a monthly fee. You could, you could also say, well, Travis, I found this offer for $19. I wanna promote it. It's also paying 50%. Well, yes, you'll get a lot more of those people but then you have to do it all over again next month, and then all over again the month after, and all over again the month after. The beautiful thing about promoting recurring products is most of the time, if you're promoting a good one, people will hang around and use it. So another great example of, of some of the affiliate revenue that I've been able to generate is Kartra. We make right around, I wanna say $700 a month in Kartra revenue from people joining Kartra um, because I give them a funnel, right? 
and you'll see a link below this video where you can go check it out. But basically anybody who joins Kartra under me gets some of my highest producing funnels. It's really easy. And what I love is Kartra actually allows me to give you the emails, the list, the tags, the pages, the whole deal. So that's pretty awesome. Um, and so all I really have to do is make a video like this, mention it to you, or maybe I would make a video that shows me using Kartra and, and how I profit from it and the email stuff that it does. And then say, hey, if you wanna sign up, go here. That's all it would really take from me and I would be able to get a couple of people to sign up. Uh, and we'll be talking more about that stuff here in the near future. But this is what I want you guys to understand and focus on is the most simple version of affiliate marketing is that right? It's this, it's finding people who might be interested in a product, helping them find that product. And when they buy from you, you get paid. The advanced version of that is, okay, let me build my list while I'm recommending people over to this offer so that I now have an email list because the key with email is you don't have to necessarily pay. You pay for an autoresponder, but that's not really the same thing. You don't have to pay every time you want to send these people an email. So let's say you make $200 per email, right? $200 per email blast that you send times, maybe you mail your list 20 times a, uh, a month, you're talking $4,000. That's $4,000 a month from a pretty small list making very little amounts of money every single day, but that's a very good sum, an accumulated sum. Uh, but you don't have to pay every time you make that 200. If this was Facebook ads, I would have to pay every time to get that traffic, right? So that's why one of the things that you need to be able to do is inherit your audience. And that's why um, it's huge to build your Instagram. It's great to build a fan page. It's great to build a group, a Facebook group. Um, it's, it's great to build a Snapchat, a TikTok, anything where you can influence people, um, even if it's only a thousand people, 2000 people, all you need, and, and my wife was a true testament to this recently, she made a post, nobody on Facebook liked it, but somebody private messaged her and said, hey, love that post, wanted to talk to you more about it. And she messaged me and she said, you never know who's listening. And that's the truth, you never know when that one person who wants to buy something from you is listening or, or is ready. Um, it's always nice not to push people constantly, you don't always be like, hey, go buy ClickFunnels, go buy ClickFunnels, go buy ClickFunnels, people don't want that show people the benefit of the product that you're trying to sell, right? Give them an easier way to implement it and then make that offer to them over time. You don't have to beat them over the head with it. So um, that's one of the things we've had some great success teaching at Chatmatic is, hey, show people how to benefit from Messenger, give them a 14 day trial. So there's a really easy way for them to implement it. And then like low barrier to entry, right? And then boom, they're in and now we can rock and roll, let Chatmatic do the rest from there, you know, as far as retaining them and letting them, you know, get the service that they were looking for. So um, this being the most basic version of affiliate marketing, this being some of the more advanced levels, the way that I was able to profit super, super uh, efficiently from uh, affiliate marketing was almost everything that I've ever done goes through some sort of a landing page or a lead building system where I'm maintaining some asset, right? I'm getting a, an email, I'm getting um, their messenger, text message, something so that I can eventually reach out to them again with new offers and not have to pay for those. Then what I do is I build up external audiences like this one right here from people who, for instance, watch my video. If I make a video saying, look at how amazing Chatmatic is, and then I make an audience of people who watch that video, I can then run ads to those people who watch. Now they're one step closer to potentially buying. So um, affiliate marketing is amazing because what's awesome to me is you don't have to do this piece and you don't have to do this piece. Somebody else already did everything else. All you've got to do is one third of the equation. You've got to find the people that want a product, but the product is already available and fulfilling that product is already also on somebody else. The customer support is also on somebody else. So you get to do 50% of the revenue from only doing, you know, it's the most important piece, but it's not necessarily the most expensive piece, uh, especially if you have inherited audiences, right? So if you have an audience of people who've opted into your list, now you can promote over and over again. Great example actually is recently I did um, a webinar where I compared Kartra to ClickFunnels, because that's a big question that's coming out recently. And we'll, we'll be posting a, a video on this channel about that as well. But I did a webinar, I compared the two against each other, and on that call, 
I said, look, if you're interested in getting either one of these and you want some of my funnels, go grab them right now. And, and four people signed up for Kartra and four people signed up for ClickFunnels. And I didn't even have a formal offer to make, right? So it's really cool because that's gonna grow your affiliate base and it's gonna grow your level of maybe making some additional income. And I just think that if you look at this number, finding 10 people who could really benefit from a ClickFunnels, a, a Chatmatic, a Kartra, or any of these, you know, SendLane, or any of these digital products, finding somebody who could benefit from it, you'd make really good money. And a uh, uh, last kind of great example is you look at something like Shopify. Um, they have an affiliate program where you get a percentage of everybody's monthly fees. And that's a really simple way to be able to make some more money, right? You just say, oh, you're looking to open a store? You should check out Shopify. They go, they sh check out Shopify, they love it. It doesn't cost them any more to sign up just because you're getting a cut. You just get your cut from Shopify, which is really cool. So now, 10 years from now, they're still run running the same store. You still get paid. So definitely want to consider affiliate marketing and everything that you do. The keys for this, make sure that you're always building an audience. Try to inherit your audience as much as possible, meaning capture people's attention along the way. Capture this. Um, look into how you can actually create some ads. We've got another video coming very, very soon that's gonna talk to you guys a little bit more in depth about the eight passive income systems that I use to generate over $10,000 a month. And that's gonna include some of the things that I've done for ClickFunnels, some of the things that I've done for Kartra, um, even things as much as like my, uh, my stock account, how much I make every month in stocks without having to really do anything. So that's gonna be a super cool video. Make sure you guys watch out for that. Aside from that, Please do me a favor, if you liked getting your head around the affiliate marketing aspects of this video, please click that like, bit, that like button. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe, share this with somebody who might find this interesting. We'll be back and always leave me a comment letting me know what you loved about this video or what you'd like me to expand more on. We're gonna be doing more videos for you guys, but I wanna do them based on what you wanna hear. So make sure you guys leave me a comment. See you soon.